Today, I'm going to share with you some exclusive insider tips on photo booths. What up, ninjas? It's Krista with Two Way Mirrors. The main question everyone is thinking about is, do you want to rent a photo booth? Buy one outright? Fully assembled, ready to go? Or should you build one? If you are hosting an event, or you have an event, and you just want a photo booth to be there, but you don't necessarily want to start a photo booth business, and you just have so many things on your plate, photo booth renting is the way to go. Now, the price may totally depend on your location. You usually go like $200 and up. But the great thing about it is, you don't have to buy anything specifically, and if you don't have a lot of space, that's great. You can have someone stroll in, put up their photo booth, and then they take it away when they're done. Bam, super easy, and they're getting paid to do it, so they're gonna make sure it's awesome, for sure. If you are not renting one, because you want it for more than one occasion, or you're doing a business, and you don't have that upfront capital to just psh, buy a photo booth outright, the next step is to build one. So, the fastest, easiest way to get started with this is to do an iPad or a tablet and download some free photo booth software just to get it rolling. The great thing about this is there are paid softwares out there that can help you control it as a business model, but at the same time, if you're doing just for personal reasons, like, whoa, you're awesome, you brought the life of the party, and you can even lower it to the little minion level. It's just amazing. So once you have your tablet or iPad, all you need now is something to hold it in place to signify that it's a photo booth. Our favorite is the ring light because it provides the lighting in case you're in the dark, like at a wedding reception. Or dance party, rave, who knows? But this LED light strip here just makes it amazing for photo booths. So you just get a ring light, a little clamp to hold the tablet in place, and then bam, you've got the ultimate photo booth. So if you're going to add a mirror in front of your ring light, AKA our Halo teleprompter, then you can still use an iPad but all you need is a little clicker. You just use this baby, like, connect it via Bluetooth, via, via Bluetooth, and then you just click that button, and then psh. So the button works with the software, which is awesome. But, wait, there's more. If you want to go even more ultimate than this, the next step in photo booth greatness is the Magic Mirror photo booth. And to do this, you basically need an acrylic two-way mirror and a display and a phone. But really, you don't have to have a display. You can just use your phone, whatever. So in this case, we have a full-length photo booth acrylic. with a little phone at the top, boom, power it up, and you've got your little clicker, shutter, and you're able to just take the picture on command and share all of the amazing memories later on your website or via Google Drive, connect it to social media, whatever works for you. Okay, so in addition to using the clicker, by the way, or the shutter, you can do voice control with the phone, and some tablets and iPads do this as well, where you can say, shoot, or cheese, or record video, and it'll start recording for you without even having to touch it, which is super sweet. Okay, if you plan to use voice control, you gotta make sure, first of all, people know what they're doing. So put up a big sign that says, say cheese, say shoot, 
all the commands. That way, when they get up there, they're not just looking like idiots in front of a mirror doing nothing. <laughs> The best way to go is actually to add like a touch overlay or touch foil with the display so you get that interactivity. We were out in the field and the most popular photo booth was this one because people could go up, take the picture, and share it super fast. People want that instant social status for mm -hmm. sure. And we do have instructions on how to build this on the website. If you have any other questions or you just love us and want more of it, Go to our website, 2amirrors.com. You won't be disappointed. And don't forget to leave me a comment with your favorite prop that I'm wearing. All right, till next time, guys. I'm out of 5,000.